Welcome back. I'm Kelsey and this is Rachel and we're here to talk about boxing. So what do you think about Alida Alvarez and his impressive knockout? Um, I think it was like an impressive knockout. Like I was in impressed, I guess you could say. Yeah. It was like kind of like out of nowhere. So maybe impressed, not the right word. I was surprised. Uh, uh, knockouts are always like, you know, fun in boxing. Um, you know, not the guy getting knocked out, but for the rest of us. And I don't know if the rest of the fight like was impressive. I am open to seeing him fight again. And uh, I think it was a really good fight for him as a, like, I guess a young up-and-coming fighter in this He's not this really division. that young. Not that young? Okay. Oh. <laughs> so, like, just up-and-coming fighter, maybe? I don't know. Uh, it was a really good opportunity for him to be able to fight Kovalev, and he happened to win. Yeah. So, like, that's just, like, a bonus for him. And he got all that good experience against, like, a fighter like this. So, yeah, like, let's see this guy against... Um, Adonis Stevenson, the lineal champion. Yeah, let's see, you know, him against the uh, other people in the division. I'm, I'm, I'm or curious. Or Dimitri Bivol, the, the guy that... That fought right yeah. before. Yeah, yeah. So, I, yeah, I'm open to seeing... Um, I don't see, like, a lot of light heavyweight fights. And so, yeah, I like this kind of size of guy. Um, you know, where they're not, like, in boxing. <laughs> in, uh, you know, sometimes heavyweights have a tendency to be out of shape. Um, <laughs> and then you get like smaller in the, you know, I don't know, maybe I'm not like a boxing purist, like the really tiny guys, like I have a hard time getting like, uh, um, you know, watching. So I, I like this kind of heavier guy, but like they are like in shape and, uh, you know, so I'm interested in, uh, seeing more fights in this, this, uh, division. Yeah, I am too. I was impressed with Alvarez because specifically, I don't know if I already said this, but specifically he had worked on that punch against Kovalev in training. And so oh, he was setting okay. him up. And his jab... So what you saw is maybe through all those rounds is Alvarez doing everything to lead to that one. So even though he no, lost those exactly. rounds... not exactly. Fighters okay. say that, but that's not exactly true. Okay. Basically, like, he had worked on a certain, like, footwork and certain... He saw, probably what happened was they saw in Kovalev certain things that Kovalev would do, and they wanted to capitalize on that. And he landed a punch, and he knocked him out, and that's great. Like, I like when people do that. Like, it shows that there's a lot of skill in boxing. Mm -hmm. um, he had a really good jab, and he was able to land it pretty hard on Kovalev early in the fight, which was impressive, because it's hard to do. Um, and I look forward to seeing him fight. Um, HBO, immediately after, Max Kellerman asked him in the ring after the fight, um... Who, if he wanted to fight Bevel next. Mm -hmm. And I was like, hmm, I don't know if that fight's going to happen because um, historically, this guy, our friend, Elider Alvarez, Elader, 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 Alvarez, um, is a PVC fighter. So I was like, he's going to take that belt, uh, all those two belts, and he's going to truck over to Al Heyman, <laughs> you know what I mean? BB, in the PVC. And now they've got, they're going to have, like, they have the, already had the lineal light heavyweight champion, and then now they're going to have most of the belts. And he's got other light heavyweights over there, too, for that kid to fight. So it's going to be an interesting time in boxing. So I feel like HBO took a major L last night, I guess is what I'm getting at, um, with the loss. You know what I mean? Um, oh, the Kovalev. Because Kovalev was there. I forgot about that. They do the yeah. With HBO. And then I yeah. thought about this a little bit before the fight. They were you run double headers like this specifically promoters and television networks to set up future fights. Like yeah. it was like here's Kovalev and here's Bivol. Uh, so like yeah, yeah. who like it's you know I mean it happens in boxing this kind of thing. So so I thought they they lost last night and I thought that uh, Kathy Duva obviously lost main events because that's her yeah. her cash cow. Anyway, I was really uh, happy for the people of Colombia. Right? I mean like that's awesome. Congratulations. Alvarez, uh, new unified champion, that's a big deal. He's been waiting a long time for this, and he did it. Viva Colombia! Do they t speak Spanish in Colombia? We don't know. Or Portuguese? We don't know. Or Colombianese? Is that a word? 